Hi right, guys, so today I'm not going to be doing a cycle vlog for reasons I've mentioned in a previous vlog I did earlier today. If you haven't seen that, go check that out, it's also on my channel. So today, to la to make up for the lack of vlog, I'm going to do something very cool, and actually I've been wanting to do for ages, but not found the reason to do so. I'm going to be shooting this. This is my 490 FPS, so 490 feet per second airsoft sniper rifle. Fires 0.28 grams or above, the heavier the better, 290 feet per second down the range. And today, the unwilling target is going to be this toy tank. I've had it for about 5 to 10 years now, actually a very long time. And it's very nice, the tracks turn on it and everything. So it's actually quite a good toy. And I've had lots of fun playing with this in the past. But... Uh, I haven't actually used it for a couple of years, so I'm just gonna just gonna have a go at shooting it. I'm gonna test its armor. I'm gonna shoot it in the front, just head on. I'm gonna shoot it in the side, and I shoot it in the rear. And I'm also gonna shoot it on the front, back, and rears of the turret, just to see what impact it has on it. And it's quite hard, so don't know what impact it's gonna have on it because that is very powerful and this seems very solid. So. Yeah, if you like to see it, leave a like. Uh, continue watching in if you want to see it. That makes no sense. Just coming up next. All right, so the sniper's loaded. The tank's ready to go with the two little people on top. If they get hit, they're going to get absolutely demolished. So, yeah, I'm ready to go. Uh, I'm going to put this outside in a t at a position about 20 feet away from me. So it's going to be quite a reasonable range. Uh, far within the range of my sniper. Just It might take the edge off it a little bit. Because I'm expecting it to go straight through. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go outside, place it there, um, get in my firing position, and film it. I'll just let you know it is very cold today. Not sure what the temperature is. I will find out for you. Alright, so it's 8 degrees Celsius. So actually, that's not cold at all, is it? But um, considering we just come for summer, and this is the coldest we've had it all year, I am freezing. So I'm going to hopefully get this done quickly, and I am cold out here, and I'm even inside the log home. So I'm going to get this done quickly, um, remember a shot to the front, back, side, side, then again on the turret, front, back, side, side, if I can hit it. I've got one practice shot to get the range in the target and stuff, so hopefully it goes well. So let me get out there and get into it. This should be quite fun actually. Alright, so let's place the tank where we want the tank to go. So let's... Shooting back from that bench there. So yeah, that should be good. Let's get the gun. Oh, tripped up. There, shoot him just there. Right, okay, so let's go back to the firing position and get the first shots down range. Okay, so that first shot was a direct hit. Not sure where it hit on the tank, so that's what we're just going to find out. Let's see what damage it's done. There you go. It just bounced straight off the armour. It's very thick armour, actually. Surprised. So let's have another shot. Again, that's a direct hit. Let's see if we can see where this one hit. I think it's very clear where this one hit. It's chipped half of that completely off. Now that's mental. Let's try to side on now. Place him there so we can see it coming, so we can duck out of the way. Let's see if we can hit it now.
Oh, I fired a couple there. And they all hit, so let's see the uh, damage. Actually, it's faring off quite well. I think that might be one, that white mark there. But apart from that, it's doing alright. Doing not, not bad at all. Let's fire some off. Alright, so I would go a bit closer, but I don't know if you've seen. But once they hit the tank, they ricochet off quite a long way. So I'm not sure how much closer I want to get without wearing goggles, and I can't be asked to go find them. So we're going to stay where we are and hopefully get some more accurate shots on the weaker parts of the tank. Alright, let's see the damage all those shots did. We'll just compare them all, so... <sighs> Let's have a look. Okay, so shots from the side didn't actually do much damage. Actually, there's two marks there. And actually, the main mark caught on the side was there. That's clearly, obviously, where a BB hit, indented and bounced off. Let's move to the front. Now, this is where the first two shots were. That little white mark there's one. And as you can see, it's chipped that off pretty nicely, actually. There's also one there, just it. The bottom of that. Let's see if I can focus. There you go, that's nice and indented there. But actually, I'm quite impressed. Nothing's, apart from that at the front, but that's obviously bound to get broken. Nothing really has broken. That's boring. So what we're going to do, see if Jimmy there can survive one shot for my BB gun. Okay, so I've put the person there, and I'm going to be firing from back there, just in the doorway. So that might should give me a better chance of hitting him, because I haven't got the sun in the scope, and I'll be able to see what I'm aiming at. So let's, let's have a go. Hopefully it doesn't ricochet and hit anything, but you know, you never know. So I'm going to shoot from here at the person which is there. Direct hit. Oh my god. That's just blown his leg off. There's no chance we're going to be able to find his leg actually. Just looking around and no, but that just shows how powerful it is. It's taking his leg off. Oh my god. Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I certainly did, it was so much fun making it. But I have got numb feet now and I'm gonna go inside and put some socks on. Maybe get into my onesie and upload this video for you. So if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of these videos, give me a subscribe. And leave a comment saying you want to see more of them. Uh, because I don't normally do videos like this. But if you do enjoy them, then I might start doing them. Because I certainly do enjoy them making them. So, yeah, if you want to see more, like, subscribe, comment if you enjoyed it. Um, if you've got any other ideas for me to shoot, I would be more than happy to do it. Um, give give us a comment in the, give us a comment in the comment section. Uh, and a like. Please subscribe. Look forward to seeing you next time for some more videos. Hopefully it's going to be a cycle vlog coming up next soon, um, but if not, it will definitely be another shooting video, because I do enjoy that. So cheers for watching, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, cheers for watching.